Keep watching Charis TV. There's a spirit of a snake on you. Come here. Huh? Yes. You dream snakes. Oh, you hear me? And now this snake is sleeping with you every night. Yes. So this spirit of a snake will leave you and expect a, a nice job. <laughs> you and speak with you at the same time. Your side here is affected. Oh, you hear me? Yes. This is more like a stroke. Because I saw you in a bed, there were times where you were failing to stand up. Yes. Huh? Yes. So I'm cancelling this stroke now. Come on! Out! Jesus' name! She's free. You're free, Mama. Yeah. 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 Something is eating your blood. Huh? Yes. Huh? Yes, okay. Your menstruation doesn't come. Yes. Huh? Yes. Because I saw that it stops for months. Yes. Oh, you hear me? Yes. So God is setting you free now. Amen. So expect your blood tonight. Amen. Come out. Ah! Come out. Yo! Out, you demon. Yo! Come out. Ah! Yo! Yo! Can you pray for her? Yeah. Come out. In Jesus' name. Come here. I'm cancelling the spirit of death in the family. Amen. Oh, you hear me? Amen. Because your mother, she's not well now. Amen. Like things are getting worse. It's, it's come here. Come here. I'm cancelling the spirit of death. Come on. You're free. Here. Come here. You. Don't divorce. Oh, you hear me? You hear me? Yes, sir. Don't divorce. Okay. Oh, you hear me? Yes. God will bring peace in your house. Thank you, Jesus. Viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Wednesday live service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T.E. Makanenisa. And with me here today is my sister who received a prophecy from the man of God, Prophet Andrew Simono. Ma, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Puti. I'm coming from Pretoria. Today you received a prophecy from the man of God, Prophet Andrew Simono. Please tell us in detail what the man of God said to you and please confirm. Yes, I'd like to confirm what man of God said regarding my marriage because it's got uh, challenges and it's been happening for a long time. Uh, me and my husband, we've been fighting with, uh, sometimes we just fight over a small thing and it become an issue. And so, to be honest, I, I was already starting to give up. And what I can say today is that uh, God has said what I, what I wanted him to tell me because I prayed about it before I come to church today, that I need a direction, a final word that I will follow regarding my marriage. That's why I had a mind of divorce due to the situation that was happening in my house. And how long has this been happening? It has been happening for a long time because we've been married for nine years, but in these nine years, uh, it's been through challenges. Uh, and uh, men of God has been praying for me uh, prophesying me about my marriage and was, I was also praying about my marriage but sometimes I was starting to lose uh, hope due to the situation that is not changing. And how has this affected you? Yeah, this has affected me a lot because I can even say recently I've been discovered that I was starting to have a, a depression regarding this issue. It has started to give me stress. So I was taking, I was even taking medication for depression. So I really thank God because now I found a solution and I believe that everything shall come to, it, it will be well. Amen. And any words of encouragement to somebody who's going through what you went through? Uh, I like to encourage uh, some other women that are going through challenges in their marriages that they should not give up, they should pray about it. God, God has an answer over the situation. Yes. And thank you so much. 
Thank you. Who is the father of your children? Huh? You, you people, there's a problem between you. Yeah, a long time. F oh, ten years me? ago. Mm -hmm. hmm? You are saying what? Yes. Did he leave you? Yeah, ten years ago. Hmm. The reason why I'm saying this is because sometimes he's regretting the decision he took. Mm. It's over. <laughs> so now, God is the God that can restore. I know you don't want that. I know. But what is it that God is saying? I know he, this man he already moved on with his life. I will pray for you. Let's allow the will of God to happen in your life. You hear me? Huh? Not that one. No, no, no. Mm. No. I didn't say it's that one. Did I say it's that one? No. Did I say it's that one? Remember, I don't know you. I say, where's the father of your children? I mean, you hear me? Yes. And you're coming for the first time? Yeah, I'm from huh? Namibia, yes. Can you see that? He's coming for the first time. And there's been an issue for 10 years. Fighting this, that. Support this. So now I'm not saying this is the man to marry you. No, 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 no. I'm saying which one is the will of God? Amen. That's what I'm saying. Amen. Which one is the will of God? Because sometimes as people we want things to happen our own way. Mm. And you find God has got his own. Hmm? Amen. You find God is doing what? He's He's got his own way. Because the issue of children has been an issue for a long time. You see, I've stopped with you. Mm. Because I want God to help. I didn't know you are coming from so far. It means God loves you. Amen. You hear me? Yes. So all your problems will be solved today. Amen. So I want to pray for you. You will decide after this prayer. Okay, prophet. <laughs> so if you receive a call, you decide whether to answer it or not. Amen. That's what I'm saying to you. Amen. The ball is in your court. Amen. But I believe God will grant your heart desires. Amen. Jesus name. And there's a house that God will give you. Receive. You've been searching for a house. Yes. So that house has come now. Amen. Viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Wednesday live service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T.E. Maganenisa. And with me here is my sister who received a prophecy from the men of God, Prophet Andres Simono. Ma'am, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Hello, my name is Helena. I'm from Namibia. I live in Rustenberg. Today you received a prophecy from the man of God. Please tell us in detail what the man of God said to you and please confirm. Yes, the man of God talked about uh, my previous marriage, my husband, and there was an issue between us. Yes, it was true. We divorced 10 years ago. And the uh, man of God said, I, I must wait for the will of God in my life. And he's also prophesying that he's in another new house coming on my way, Jesus' name. And how do you feel that today you received direction from the men of God? How do you feel that today you received direction from the men of God? Yo, um, I, I thank God because I really prayed for this day today and uh, I thank God for everything that the word of God will manifest in my life as the man of God said to me. And any words of encouragement to somebody who's currently watching us? Yeah, yes. I want to encourage all the, 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 the people, those who want to travel here, uh, they, they must feel free and they will come to receive their 
their prophecy and the word of God. Thank you so much. Thank you. Where is your mom? Because I'm, she, I'm seeing someone who died. Huh? Hmm? My mother. Hmm, I'm seeing someone who died. But since the person died, the family is not together. Are you hearing me? You people, you are divided. So I'm praying for unity again. Okay. And God has healed you also. Thank you. Even this poverty is over. You are free. There was a time when you were eating food, they are coming out. Huh? Yes. I'm seeing sources inside your system. Yeah. Inside here. Yes. Are you hearing me? Yes, I can. Because I saw you eating and you're vomiting. Yes. Eating, vomiting. So God will heal you now. Okay, the yes. sources okay. will be healed now. Viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Wednesday live service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T.E. Makanenisa. And with me here today is my sister who received a prophecy from Prophet Andre Simono. Ma, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Okay, my name is Nomsa Zungu. I'm staying at Mini Mandela, but I'm coming from KZN. Today you received a prophecy from the man of God. Please tell us in detail what the man of God said to you and please confirm. Okay. Uh, the man of God said that I'm, um, I eat, when I eat then I vomit. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, it's true. It happens every time. When I, sometimes when I eat then I have to vomit. So I was surprised what is costing that. And then he said that my system then is also moving. Yeah, I'm also having the pain here. Yeah? So I'm always, always, when I'm sleeping, I'm always surprised. So what the, the pain is coming from. So today I found out that I have a problem. And how long has this been going on? Yeah, it has been going on for four years. So I was, but now and then it's like it's, it's getting worse. But then I pray to God that God, because uh, is God has prophesied it. So then I know that now and then I'm healed. Amen. And how, please tell us how has this yes, been affecting yes. you? Yeah, it has been affecting me because sometimes you find that when I'm sleeping, then I have to wake up and then I have to sit because I'll be feeling the pains. So it's really has been affecting me. And how do you feel today that a problem that's been happening for so many years has been located today by the man of God and you were prayed for and delivered? Yo, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling very happy. I don't want to lie to you. I'm, I've been coming in from this church from September. But today, then something come out from me, then I'm very happy. I thank God for that. And any words of encouragement to somebody who's currently watching us? Okay, uh, the word of encouragement that I can tell the person that you, you believe to God and you always pray wherever you are. Then you must know that God will always help you, no, no matter what the problem is. God is always God and God is always great and God loves you. Amen. Okay, thanks very much. I'm cancelling death. Are you hearing me? I'm cancelling death Amen. for a child who's sick. You hear me? Yes. This is the spirit of epilepsy. Oh, it's my brother. How old is your brother? How old is your brother? I think he's 29 years now. He's 29? Yes. No free, sir. You're still a child. Your brother is still a child. 